Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be planning for the week of June 22nd through the 28th. I'm gonna be using this beautiful kit from Annika Creative Closet. It's called Protect Your Energy. Um, so you, it's a mini kit, so you get six full boxes, some uh, dots, deco, to-do headers, date covers, and then a full sheet of larger decorative um, deco. So it's on matte paper. It's a really beautiful design. I absolutely love it. I think she has larger kits than this. I'm not 100% positive. I don't think she released everything that way um, as far as I saw. I didn't see she also or i'm also going to be combining it with this four page full box um deco boxes and this is from planner aesthetic this is called the little things i figured that the boxes kind of went well together and i wanted to see what i could create with that so i'm gonna go ahead and pull these off they're both um, on matte paper they're both absolutely stunning and i thought this would be perfect for this week um these are two really amazing shops and they are both black owned. So make sure to check them out. I will have them linked down below. Um, yeah, I absolutely adore everything about this. I love the daisies. I love the book pages, the candles. Everything is so stunning. And then here again, you just have these positive quotes in the books that say stay positive, focus on the good. You are blessed, enjoy every moment, stay safe, only good vibes, and then you have to stay home and stay safe. So I figured this was good this week, especially considering um, it will really reflect with everything that's going on in the world currently and then was really um, going on here. I mean, not that things aren't really going on right now, but um, things are slowly as far as, um, you know, COVID. I mean, nothing's really been fixed, right? But things are slowly starting to open up now. You're not, I don't know, at least in Arizona, you're not quarantining as much. I mean, I still am trying to as much as possible. I am back at work, which was really nerve wracking, to be honest. And if I sound tired, it's because I'm absolutely exhausted. I wasn't able or just didn't post any videos this past week, which I just really really thought about um and it was kind of weighing on me but at the end of the day like i'm trying to get back into my routine and i was so scared to go back to work i don't know if i talked about this in my last in this video but um oh i just love this spread the month of june honestly makes me so happy anyways okay so let's just go ahead and keep going into this i'm gonna go ahead and rearrange these full boxes i have six seven eight nine oh i have ten what am i gonna do here okay i'll just figure it out all right so i'm gonna rearrange this and i'll be right back okay so i went ahead and rearranged it i'm deciding not to go with this one and i will figure out a different place to put it okay hopefully that's all in focus um so yeah I started back at work with work this week, which was, well, last week was the training. Um, so every year, which I do, I, did, I think I did explain this in um, my last video, but every year we do that, the teacher training week where you set up your classroom and you get all your licensing um, or you take all like, you know, you take a couple continuing ed, you have your staff meetings, just things like that. Um, so we had that. Um, and then we had a week where, um, oh, this is gonna bug me. Okay, hang on, there we go. Perfect. Okay, yeah, that looks good. Okay. <clears throat> okay, all better. Um, so then we had a week where it was just three days, which was last week. So last week we only, we started school on Wednesday 
and obviously Wednesday to Friday didn't have to work. Saturday or Sunday, obviously. Um, and then this was our first full week. So it's been quite a bit of adjustment. I've been really extremely exhausted, but I am just gonna be grateful that I have a job and grateful that I like my job. Um, I'm just, you know, like anybody else would be nervous to be back in the field. Um, but I'm not gonna complain. There's been so many forefront um, essential workers who have been doing this throughout the entire time. So um, I'm just gonna be grateful. And, and yeah, so I start, okay, this has nothing to do with this week, which I will talk about this week, but, um, oh, how do I want to do this? I was gonna do my to-do headers. I guess I, I kind of wanted to scatter things, but I guess not. Well, I don't really want to do to-do. Should I still scatter it? I mean, I don't have anything like to do to do. I could save these for a different planner. Maybe that's what I'll do, but what else will I? I love these, so I'm gonna definitely try to pull in some more pink this week. Um, instead. Yeah, let's save these for something else, although they do go obviously really well because they're from the kit. Um, I'll find a different header. Hang on. Let's see. So I've got the solid gold. I have the scallop pink. I was thinking about putting these over the solid gold. I thought that could be fun. It might be a little much. What if I just did those by themselves? That could be pretty. Or, you know, since this kit is so light and airy, I could pull something that I haven't done in a while, which is, um, use like that. I think these ones might just be too thin. Those ones are a bit thicker. Let's do that. Let me just see what I have in here. Probably should pick up some more. Oh, we have that. Oh, and that. Okay, we have some more bows here. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, let's see. So we've got some options. I think I would want to do like those two, maybe not, maybe the tan. I definitely want to pull in some pink, so we will probably be using that and then let's do the gold. And that, that might be a lot of bows. <laughs> Okay, let me see here. The gold I'm gonna start by putting here. Okay, so as I'm trying to work through this, let's chat, or I'm gonna kind of continue what I was talking about before. I'm starting back at grad school. Um, it's a Friday night, so I'm starting back at grad school a week from yesterday, which you'll either be seeing, I'm thinking this will go up on a Sunday just because um, I'm not Sunday on Tuesday, just because this weekend is quite a busy weekend for me. Um, I should, it would have been a weekend that I should have prepped, but I just didn't between the craziness of everything, which is obviously no excuse, but um, yeah, so you'll be seeing this on a Tuesday, I'm assuming. And I go back to grad school on Thursday. I'm so excited. I honestly, like, I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm actually doing it. I'm going back to become a licensed elementary school teacher because currently I am a um, preschool teacher, a pre-K teacher. Um, 
which you don't need to be licensed for. Um, okay, I probably cut that a little short. I need to learn. I like that. And then, do we want to do this? Oh my goodness, I should shut my door. My dad turned his the TV up so loud. I don't like that. I want to do pink. Oh my gosh, why is the TV so loud? He's literally all the way out in the living room. Can you hear that? Okay. So with that, I want a pink or maybe even a nude just to bring some more color into it. Maybe not this though. Okay. Um, okay. What did you do? Did I have pink? I feel like I would have. Yeah, I just have the scallop, which is what I'm using. Oh, I have those. That would have been nice. This would have been really nice. Oh my goodness, this is a bit of a bummer. Why am I such a pink, pink fanatic? I use all of my pink things. You know, I might have a pink glitter headers. I do. Okay. Let's see. A little too bright. Maybe something a bit more muted like that, or like this. I'm thinking maybe this. This might work well. It adds that, you know, pop of pink, which would be nice. Okay, I'm not mad at it. I'm not like a big glitter header fan. Um, and all the ones that I'm liking, that I'm seeing that I'm liking, I've used. <laughs> and just have like the, the actual like flags and things like that. Okay. Oh, this one would be beautiful too. It's just a smidge lighter. Oh, hi, okay. Just a bit lighter. Hmm. No, I don't like that as much for some reason. I don't, I don't know if it's the sparkle or... I did not pull things out for my sidebar yet. So I'm gonna have to do that. I really like the grit of this glitter, but that's fine. Um, anyways, yeah, I'm excited to start grad school. I honestly can't believe I'm doing it. You know what? I didn't make sure I had enough of these gold foil tutters. Oh, goodness. I mean, Sarah Nicole. Probably gonna have to cut that out. I just said my whole name. Okay, I might, I might, I might. Hmm, going wonky on me. There we go. I'm nervous, you guys. Okay, that goes up here. I honestly never thought I'd be one to do this with my headers, and yet I, here I am just loving it. Oh my gosh, speaking of, I, well, headers, not headers, but I, um, let me just make sure I get that right. Yeah, that's perfect. I, now that I'm back working and have you know, not as much that I want to tally down that I do at work. Like, I, I mean, um, I keep track of that, but, like, in a different way. Like, what 
theme of the week is it like this week was all about me next week's mascot so like our classroom um, animal um, so I keep track of that in that way and it's not something I necessarily want to keep tracking in my like personal planner where is my okay of course it turns off on me so I don't even remember what I was saying but um, or what you missed but basically what I was saying was um, I don't the reason I'm using these scalloped headers instead of the ones that are already pre-cut so this is technically bottom washi scallops um, so you just put it at the top of like your bottom washi however as you see and as you might know your girl does not use um, bottom washi and I just personally like it better best that way um, if that makes sense it gives me more room and I just after doing this I like the look of it a lot better which by the way is probably a good way to a good lead into explaining why I don't use bottom washi or how I started doing that. So basically, um, if you've been around for some time, um, I used to be subscribed, you would know, I um, used to be subscribed to the Pink Room Co, her subscription, which is an absolutely phenomenal subscription. Her, um, her sticker designs are just so unbelievably unique. Just honestly, like nothing I've ever seen before. She's still, I mean, even to this day, how things, um, you can kind of find some things similar um, shop to shop. She's still a shop that I um, think is just so unique to her and her stickers, but you only can get some of her stickers, specifically um, her monthly, um, through her subscription and when I was sub subscribed back then which I think her kit format has changed but back then it didn't come with bottom washi and it didn't come with um it only came with five full boxes so what I would do um was to just get more creative with it is I obviously did this and instead of um, I would do every other and these two boxes I would do my washi um, like cut strips of washi and I would create that as a full box and that's honestly just I don't know what made what made me do that I don't know why all of a sudden I was like you know what I'm gonna try doing this and I'm gonna try pushing um, you know using my washi as full boxes well actually I do know that part um, I have so much washi and I want to use it, but I never do. So I've just been hoarding my washi. And this was when I was buying so much wash washi from um, Simply Gilded because her bow, um, her bow washi had like seriously just taken off. Everybody was buying it. I mean, her bow washi is still absolutely stunning and I, everyone I'm sure is still buying it. I've just kind of limited it and um for me these days but I mean this was back then you couldn't even get your hands on you would have like had to have ninja fingers when you ordered from her and she just started her subscription and all seriously amazing things but yeah that's basically the story of that um I would highly suggest checking out the Pink Room Co. She's got some seriously phenomenal stickers. See, I just adore that. That looks great. I'm really, really happy with that. Okay. So kind of going back to work, we have to wear a mask all day, which most um, people, if you are out in the field working, you're wearing a mask all day. Um, you know, you probably know what I mean. Um, but these days I like come home and when I don't have it, I feel like around my face or around like my, um, lips, um, it's like, it feels weird. Do you feel that if you're wearing a mask all day? And by the end of the week, I was like, I just don't want to wear a mask anymore. Like my mouth hurts it's so raw. I have so much acne. Um, again, I'm not complaining to, com I'm, you know, I'm just kind of 
talking with you, you know? I don't want to complain. I obviously am very grateful. I'm wearing my mask for a reason. I know the benefits of wearing a mask. I'm just, you know, talking as it might be something we all can relate to. Definitely don't want to come across as complaining though. Um, but yes. So these are the date covers from the kids and I figured I could just find some date dots and pop it on top. I have some really beautiful ones from Nettie Designs. They're a bit larger, so I rarely use them because um, they don't really fit in a date, um, you know, like a date, what would you call this? A date cover? Date, date covers? That sounds wrong for me, but I feel like, like it sounds wrong coming out of the mouth, but it feels like that might be the the case. Wow, Friday is really bold. Today is Friday, I think I mentioned, and it's definitely like a fry yay day because oh, getting through this week was it felt like ages. I keep thinking like, oh, I'm back to work like week one, week full week one down. Um but it honestly feels like I've been back for ages. Like this week has just been the longest, but also super quick, if you know what I mean. I mean, I don't even know. So I have to pull out sidebar items still, so I'm just gonna go ahead, excuse me, and start going in day by day, and then we'll do sidebar at the end. Excuse me, oh my goodness. So, more of my tweezers. I'm gonna start by doing another sticker, or one of these beautiful face, face mask stickers from Annika Creative Closet. I think this is so amazing that she came out with these stickers. Okay, so we did that. Um, and that is for, let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, let's do three up here. Actually, let's do two here. And, okay. So I had, I was in St. Louis. If you saw my last week's plan with me, I had to go for my five year back checkup. I had surgery five years ago, um, which seems so stinking insane. Um, and honestly incredible. I feel like it was just yesterday, but um, yeah, five years ago I had spinal fusion surgery. So my doctor is amazing and you basically go in, I went in one year, did I do one year, three years, five years as my checkup and then I go in at seven years, 10 years, 15, 20, 25, and I think you go until 35 or 40 years out. I mean, honestly, okay, not to be mean, but like my doctor's not young. <laughs> I mean, is he gonna retire, like retire at some point? I don't really know. So if I still am seeing my doctor in 35 years, I personally am gonna be very impressed very impressed with my doctor, okay. <laughs> so here is to mark that we flew home. So we flew to Texas and then to Arizona. Um, for some reason, every time I travel, I always come back to Arizona craving Chipotle, like I just want a burrito. So my dad and I stopped to pick up Chipotle. I don't know why, I don't know why, I always crave it. And then, I watched Gilmore Girls, so let's do this. And for some reason, now after saying that, I really just want to get in bed and watch Gilmore Girls, probably because I'm so tired. And then, oh, my nap sticker's gone. I need to pull out another pillow because I finished up that, um, oh my gosh, isn't this sticker so cute, Quarantine and Show? Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Okay, um, nap, here we go. Here we are, let's do, let's do the scallop. Okay, 
and then I took another nap. I took a nap in St. Louis, St. Louis, and then I came home to Arizona, watched Gilmore's, and took another nap, and then proceeded to go to bed at a reasonable time that night. I was clearly exhausted. So on Tuesday, June 23rd, an exciting day for me personally, because that was exactly five years to the day. So I'm gonna take a quarter box here, and this one is from Panda Bird Designs. I need to go pick up some more stickers from her now that she's open because I'm just adoring her stickers to absolute pieces. I honestly think they are the sweetest little stickers. And then I posted on Bloom, which was really exciting. So from the pink, um, pretty pink co, I'm gonna take a little YouTube sticker. Um, this is when I actually uploaded my, um, what's it called? Like Bloom Updates sticker, or sticker. Bloom Updates, why don't, did I almost say sticker again? Bloom Update video. Um, yeah, I was so nervous to post that. Did I, yeah, I, yeah, I was so nervous to post that which honestly it hasn't even gotten many views, which is completely fine because I'm so like still so nervous about it. I don't know if I've mentioned before, but like I'm non-confrontational. I usually keep my mouth shut and that things like that. But some things are just too important to keep your mouth shut and that was one of them. And yeah, so now I think, should I use gray? No, let's do pink. I'm such a pink person. Do they have a sheet that I was already using though? Cause I feel like I did. Sorry, bear with me. Oh yeah, I did. Boy, they, one day, when do you think I will actually start noticing before noticing um or being able to catch my camera shut off because i don't know if that day will ever come i hope so because i'm sure it's very very annoying but i don't know clearly i'm not getting the hang of it now how many years has it been it's been a while okay i'm gonna do four even though i only have three marked it down that looks so sweet i just love that Oh my Atlanta. Okay, let's do. So I had therapy. I normally just call her Laura though. Who? I always get so nervous, like actually putting down therapy because. Well, most people in my life don't know I go to therapy, except for the internet. Okay, I'm not gonna actually write that down. I'm gonna use the asterisk sticker from this Rose Colored Days sampler. Okay. And then let's go ahead and do this little paper clip from Cle a Clever Gal Crafts. No, goodness, Crafts by Towie. I will. I don't think I'll ever get that, honestly, for the return. And then I had some other things going on, but not even gonna bother by marking those. Okay. Um, on Wednesday, Wednesday, starting with the whole boys situation, little scalloped flag. Oh, I really took it from over there. Okay. Okay. Little scalloped flag. And then from Cross by Towie, the daycare sticker and then 
from Night Designs. I'm going to take four, five of these. Let's just do four. Could probably combined. I don't even know. Oh, Mary Poppins. Goodness, I the amount of times I watch Mary Poppins. I was watching, so there's this thing called Storyline Online, and it's where um, famous actors and actresses um, read children's stories and post it online and um, on this website. And the guy from, um, what's it called? The guy from the Bridesmaids, um, the Irish guy. He also plays the dog in Mary Poppins when they go to like the porcelain bowl. And so without even look at the, looking at the computer, I was getting my um, like um, board ready. I had the kids paint, or not paint, but like, how do I even say this? Like there was little cut out people and they put hair and eyes and clothes on these people. And then I surrounded it with their birthday and their pictures. So while I was doing that board, they were watching the story and this is during um, quiet hours slash nap time. And um, holy, oh my Lanta, why did they spend so much? Anyways, let me finish the story and then I'll tell you what I'm talking about. So, uh, yeah, so before I even turned around to see who was reading, I heard that voice and it was the dog from Mary Poppins, which meant it was this actor. Um, so funny. So this weekend I mentioned it was my friend's birthday. So we're having a couple, over, couple of people over at... Um, at not the birthday boys um, place, but a different friend's place. And we're just, they got mimosas. He wanted to do like bottomless mimosas, but obviously it's court. Like we still have to be super conscious about even being around each other. They're all my coworkers, by the way. So, I mean, not that that makes that better, but it is what it is. And so we um, were like, okay, let's go to Costco and just get some bottles of champagne and some OJ and things like that. Breakfast. And we'll just do our little at-home bottomless mimosas, which will probably be cheaper and 100% times more safe. So um, we were all supposed to go tonight, but I was extremely exhausted and did not feel like driving an hour to uh, 30 minutes home and then an hour to, um, this is Thursday. Okay. And then, um, an hour to my friend's house to go with them to Costco. And then we were also going to make like cute t-shirts and stuff like that because one of the friend has a cricket. So I was like, you know what? Since I'm gonna be with you guys all weekend, we're gonna lay by the pool tomorrow, and then the mimosas on Sunday, I'm just gonna stay back. So you guys go to Costco and let me know what's up, and I will Venmo you guys some money, just because obviously the birthday boy shouldn't be paying, and I didn't want the other friend to put all of that on her. I mean, we're all broke teachers, so. Um, yeah, so they just sent me the damage and holy cannolis, they spent a shiz ton of money, which I guess is not hard to do at Costco because you're like, yeah, I'm by, I'm getting such a good deal. And then, I mean, I'm sure it's easy to fall down that rabbit hole, but oh my gosh, my wallet hurts just looking at that. 
I'm trying not to spend any money. I haven't bought stickers in a while, which go me, although I did get a, um, you know, a, a Etsy gift card for my birthday, which was freaking phenomenal. I started listing some clothes on Depop, so I'm just hoping to start selling some things soon. And I restarted really cracking down on my budget planner, so hopefully my finances, you know, I mean, nothing's gonna get better. I'm a teacher and I'm going back to grad school, but not that anybody cares about any of this. And then let's do three here. So we need the coffee mug again. Oh, I have this cute coffee mug. It's kind of big, but let's do it. Gosh, so many random ta tangents tonight. I hope you don't mind and I hope you don't judge. But I guess it is what it is. So I went and picked up coffee for my sister and I. I swam laps that night and then I also FaceTimed my nephew. So the nephew I watched, we FaceTimed. <laughs> Just gonna put it a bit over. Oh, hi, okay. FaceTime, perfect, that's all fine with me. Okay, Friday morning, I had a horrible night's sleep. I don't know why I couldn't sleep, but from Once More With Love, the two year anniversary favorites, I'm taking this adorable freaking um, munchkin, like just bleh. And the coffee cup says, ugh. So I think that's so perfect. I have a feeling my camera's gonna turn off soon, so I'm gonna try to keep an eye on it, but if it does and I don't catch it, I'm so sorry. Um, I made a smoothie, so from Harriet Wright Designs, I'm gonna take a smoothie icon, which I think is just genius. And then I watched the boys, but I don't think there was much to report there, so um, I don't have like my usual checklist, but I can still put this down. Um, I hope it starts raining in Arizona soon. We had like a big storm um, like last weekend, I think, but I'm ready for some more rain, you know what I'm saying? This adorable sticker sheet from Sticker Bloom. I had wine that night, so oh, I just love this sticker. I wonder if she still has those, because if so, I definitely want to pick some more up. Super sweet. And then that night, oh my goodness, that night, I got ready for a date, and then he canceled the date. We were just gonna do movie night, so it's not like anything too crazy it literally was gonna be quarantine and chill but um, got canceled so what's she gonna do right so I got all dressed and ready and then it was canceled so I got undressed unready and watched once upon a time on Saturday morning I slept all the way in so I'm going back in with my Samantha May Sticks scalloped pillow. I, oh, I ran some fun errands with my little sister, which was so nice. Let's do like that. And then I want to go back in with these dots. So we went three places. Here we go. It is like 115 degrees outside and I'm in sweatpants. Tell me why. Tell me why. 
Does that look too smushy? No. That's fine. Alright. Um, so after that, oh, we had a family zoom. So let's take from Paper Blush Bar this pillow. I almost said pillow. Goodness, no. Oh, I just sounded like Pete the Cat. Goodness, no. Can you tell I'm a pre-K teacher? Or thought I work with kids. I mean, I've only been back to work for one week. I need to stop it. Although I did, I did put that on for my nephews, so not that big of a deal. Mmm. Let's do. That's pretty. Let's keep that date night. And then Sunday. So Sunday we ran to the store. So I think I'll just take like the dot here. And then swimming day. Oh, I should have done. How many of this? Okay. Let's do that there. And then, um, I'm going to take the, f oh, you know what? I want my single Pringle sheet. Where is that? Mm, that's from Comfy Monsters Co. Single Pringles. That's so funny. Go ahead. So, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do just a little guy. There, and then, oh, I washed my brushes. Go with me. Let's do the pink ones. Washed my brushes and then I watched two movies and did some laundry. So I have this sheet from Station Stickers. I was gonna take that laundry sticker. Tell me why I'm I'm actually, I was going to put little bullet points for the movies I watched, but that's fine with me. Yay! Okay, so that is that. Now I just have to figure out my sidebar. Well, I really pulled a lot of pink into this. I mean, I'm not complaining, but hello. Okay, sidebar time. So I have that and then maybe do here and then I'm gonna pull in some of those headers that one actually would also be really nice which one would be rather I'm kind of digging that one let's see 
we don't like it, things can be changed. Put those headers back out. All right, so the card was full, <laughs> but that's okay. Um, we got it all fixed up and figured out. So I'm just gonna go with this one instead. I think it kind of will incorporate incorporate that. Oh shoot, nuggets! I put away my headers. Why would I do that? I like cleaned up as I was waiting for my memory card to um, upload to my computer. Another header. It's so interesting to see how your planning style evolves. Okay. And then that. And then I think the last thing I'm just going to do is take like a Clever Gal Crafts. Flag. Beautiful. Um, probably should put that away. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fill all of this out and I shall be back in a bit. It's fine, you're missing this. Okay. Okay, so I finished filling it all out. Now I'm just going to take my Netty Designs um, date dots and um, put them at the top of every date just to kind of finish things off. But yeah, these are going to look good really know what date it is, what the date is. Um, I guess I probably could have done this off camera, but I didn't, so here we are. Mm. Kind of ripped off the beginning of that too. Should I try to piece it together? Yeah, you know, it also gives like a nice little, um, like foil pop above the darkness of the black lettering. Sorry, I'm just trying to pull these off. Oh, nuggets, I ripped this one. Kind of giving me a hard time. Okay. 25. I love the way this spread turned out. I think it looks absolutely beautiful. Yay! Okay, so this is how it turned out. I think it looks absolutely stunning. I'm obsessed with the way um, it just worked out. The pink looks really amazing, which I was a little nervous about since there wasn't a ton in the full boxes, but combining the two, the kit from Annika Creative closet and then the full boxes from um, Planner Aesthetic. I just think it looks absolutely stunning. I will have both shops linked down below so make sure to check them out. Um, make sure to check out my Instagram to find out more in, de in de more details, more in-depth details as far as going with that one. Um, I should have all of the shops linked there um, and some up close photos but yeah. Oh I added this Keep Going sticker, which I believe is also from, um, let's actually make sure, yes, from Annika Creative Closet. Can you tell I'm kind of on our stickers? Now that I have my gift card, I know where I'm going, right? Where I'm going to shop, Panda Break Designs, Annika Creative Closet, gotta get the list going, but anyways, thank you so much for watching, for all of your love and support. Course, make sure to subscribe, um, like, and comment. I love talking with you when you do um, comment. It really does make me happy. So make sure to do that if you feel inspired or encouraged to. Um, I hope you're having an amazing day, week, and month. And until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye.